One of the projects we have is blockchain in practice, which is looking at how blockchain technologies, or specifically distributed ledger technology, uh, can help to streamline and strengthen non-proliferation of chemical, biological, nuclear, and radiological materials. I'm Cindy Vestigard, Director of the Nuclear Safeguards Program. A number of the challenges in, when it comes to non-proliferation are problems with provenance. So is the material trustworthy and traceable? Also in terms of reducing uh, risks when it comes to high value targets, such as the materials, the facilities and the equipment. We will be developing and testing a small scale demonstration uh, for a DLT platform for a state system of accounting and control. So we're curious about the potential for DLT to be able to help to streamline this process and make it easier. If this works, we'll be able to demonstrate chain of custody throughout the full supply chain, whether it be nuclear materials, chemical or biological. Because it's the first time we're doing this, the test will be able to show the feasibility of the technology for uh, safeguards information management. Once we've demonstrated that it's feasible, the next step will be able to apply it to a full proof of concept. At Stimson, I have the space to be able to engage with a variety of stakeholders, be able to study the policy issues, the gaps, the areas where there's really challenges or blockages, and how we can streamline that, really taking ideas uh, and putting them into reality.